Mission Break series one minute review. The show is about two brothers, one of whom is framed and the other of whom try to break him out using brains more than brawn. The show is almost always at its best when it is about people breaking out of you know, confinement. It does sometimes do interesting things elsewhere, but that is by far the most interesting overall. The first season is probably the best overall. The second is also pretty good. The third one likewise, if short. The fourth one, they make the unfortunate decision to pretty much throw all of the surviving main characters into one group, losing a lot of tension and costing most of them development because there simply isn't room for all of them before they would switch back and forth between who there would be focus on who would be in the show and now they kind of have pretty much all of them. The characters tend to be relatively straightforward and unambiguous other than Robert Knepper as Teabag, a psychotic rapist redneck who is clearly very intelligent and who you do feel could have you know, done something very positive. It's the Godfather 3 thing. They keep pulling me back in, you know. He's got a real Gollum quality to him. The show does do some action, but it is mostly tension. It is mostly risky situations where you're sure that everything could be blown in a couple of seconds if something goes even a little bit wrong. But it does do action sometimes, and it does it well. Brett Ratner lends his expertise in that area, and let's grant him, he does have expertise in that area. Some. And we get some nice shootouts and chases, vehicular and otherwise, and they tend to be pretty fun. The very last two episodes offer an alternate ending of sorts to the show that had already had its ending, and the alternate ending is in my opinion, not quite as good. So if you watch the second to penultimate episode and you like that ending, consider if you don't want to just stick with that, pretend that that's the complete ending.